channel, MZ's Youngsies. I'm Emily and today we are going to be making chocolate pancakes. But before we get started, make sure you give me a big thumbs up, subscribe to my channel and turn the post notification bell on so you never miss any of the videos I do. So let's get started. So the first thing we're going to do is we are going to put the oil into the pan. So, let's open the oil. Okay guys, so then you have to um, swirl it around like this. It's probably a little bit too much, just a little bit less you'll need to start your first pancake, but it should be fine when it's heated up. Okay, so, so. now we have to put the, the thing on to about four, mm -hmm. like that. And now guys, whilst that is, well, whilst we turn the pan, now we're going to show you what we need. So this is what we'll need. So, you'll need some flour with the cocoa powder if, if you chocolate. want to. You'll need a whisk. You'll need some milk. 300 mils. Yeah. So, the flour's 100 grams and the milk is well, 300, 300 mils. mils. And then you'll need two eggs and a bowl. And we are also using a cutter. <laughs> yeah, we're going to do into the heart shape. So, yes. Let's, first of all, what you have to do is mix in in the ingredients the dry ingredients so basically we're just going to add in the flour and the cocoa powder in for as much and as the, we can yep, and then, and then the, eggs. the eggs and then we're going to add the milk after don't get any eggshell in it okay guys so that's one egg and now we're going to add the other egg oh Also, happy pancake Excellent. day, everyone. Yep, that's why we're making pancakes right now. So now we have to add into the in the milk. And then we give it a good whisk. And I've got my panda whisk. <laughs> this is a really nice whisk. And you give it a whisk until it's smooth. And then this will be your pancake batter. Okay, guys, so we we've just got it to this stage. It. This You have to mix for a little bit, but it's not that long. But um, now that you, it, after you've mixed now it. Now it's nice and smooth. What you have to do is you have to put a little bit into the pan and um, wait for it to go a bit. So you have to try like aim for the middle, not like the side. And then twirl it all around. Yep. And just put it somewhere and then you have to like... <laughs> Oh, See, that. we've put a little bit too much um, oil. oil, but our first pancake's not going to be one we're going to keep anyway. We're doing this the second pancake. So we'll be back when we're doing the second pancake. Hey guys, so we've oh. done the first one. <laughs> Emily wasn't ready then. So we've done the first one, uh, which came out, obviously as normally, first pancakes come out disastrous. So we're hoping yeah. this turns out okay. So what we're going to do is pour more of the mixture than we did last time. Does it keep pouring? And that should be fine. Okay, guys, now we just wait. We'll be back when we flipped it. Hi, guys. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> so, guys, we You're have to sick. add more flour. So, the first couple of pancakes we did turned out very wrong, and we realised what it is, is we'd done the oil right, we did the temperature right, but the mixture we was told to do from online, it said to only do 100 grams of flour. Before this started, I knew that didn't sound right with 300 mils of water. So milk. I'm guessing that was more for milk. crepes. Sorry, milk. Uh, I'm guessing that was more for crepes. So what we've done is we've added more flour uh, to the mixture and we've made it a lot easier. And this is nearly done, and guys. And also, guys, you actually have to have them free because if you put we we uh, we tried to put it on a bit higher because it wasn't quick, but then we realised that yeah, but four's okay. Guys, this is looking good so far. So we'll be back when we plated it up. Yep. So guys, this is the next pancake we made, which was a lot more rounder and a lot thicker. Yep. And just looks a lot better than the other one. Because <laughs> if you look, guys, right, okay? This is the other one. This is like kind of like put there <laughs> and like... Yeah, and this, this... It, it does look yummy and it smells yummy, but oh, look at this one, guys. That's what you're going to want. Because you it? have to wait for, for the next surprise. Which Emily already do. gave away. <laughs> okay, guys, mm. so we're going to be back in a second. 
Guys, you see that Emily's laughing right now. Do you know why she's laughing? Because I said we just made a perfect pancake. Yeah. <laughs> and then I got it out and... um. Um. um yeah, I didn't get it out very well. And our surprise was these singing jeans. This Christmas. Week. Yeah, so we're gonna be making Christmas heart pancakes and sprinkles banana. and banana. Woo! Okay, we're gonna do this. Okay, guys. So we're gonna set the plate up really nice, and we're gonna show you the results we'll right after. Back. Okay, guys. So we're back and look. We're not done yet, but that's what it looks like. Ice cream and then bananas and the pancakes into hearts that we use for this. But now we're adding sprinkles. We always use these Christmas sprinkles because these are good. I'm using the gold ones. Look how good that looks stuff. though, guys. Just look at it. Where do we put them? Should we just put them on, like, some on each heart or whatever? Wherever you want, darling. Hey, guys. First, I'm going to add some onto the ice cream. Uh oh. Unless they fall off, <laughs> which is happening. So, yeah, yeah, guys, it's simple. All you do is you make your pancake mix. And then um, you guys you you can add any toppings you want as yeah, well. Yeah, any toppings. Use any shape to cut it out when no pancake is cool. Or you can just have a normal pancake. It's up to you what you guys do. But, guys, do. right, the best tasting pancakes come with ice cream. I swear, try it today. Try pancakes and ice cream together and you will never go back. Guys, yeah, comment down below if you made pancakes today. Like, comment down below if you... Yeah, um, tell us what kind of pancakes you've made today, or if you've had any today. Yeah, because that would be good to know, so we know, like... And also, tell us if you put shapes on them or anything. So, guys, we're all done. We've added some onto these and just some on them. And How good does that look now? Yeah, Emily's going to try every little bit of everything for you. So, I need to go get a... Or something. You can use that one, can't you? I can just use this one, yeah. <laughs> right, so first of all, I have to get... I'm going to get a little, a little bit, bit of it. Pancake. Come on. The heart's broken. Mm. It's okay. And we were actually going to do butterflies, but... And a bit of banana. Yeah, we was going to do butterflies, but I can't find my butterfly stencil thing. Is this all of it? Yeah. And here goes the taste test. Ready? Do, 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 do. Hold. Mmm. Ice cream makes it taste better, don't it? <laughs> does she agree or does she disagree? Okay. <laughs> also, guys, we got this new mixer. My Emily's dad and my partner bought it and for Valentine's Day. And I'm so happy with it. Look at it, guys. It's a food processor. Okay. It's to help us with our channel. And we could have actually used that for the pancakes, but I didn't want to get it too it chocolatey just okay, yet. Guys. We should have it with the thing that we made yesterday, but I'm not going to say that now because i don't want yeah we haven't put the video it. on yeah if you haven't yeah. watched it then we, we don't want to give it away it yeah i don't think we've uploaded it yet but no um the video that we're gonna upload first which we did and this we that's what that is what you should have yeah okay guys so that, it's out it's 10 out of 10 by the way so. yeah emily gave it 10 out of 10 okay bye guys don't forget to subscribe because it helps like, our channel and turn the post notification bell <laughs> we'll see you in the next video bye, bye.